understanding, a public speaking class is more what I mean. And she had to memorize this poem and share it with her class. And she told me she felt very, very scared. And it was like, because she's a shy lady, I suppose. Mm -hmm. um, but she has always read this poem to me. So it just, it, this makes me think of my mom a lot. Huh. <laughs> she was very happy to memorize it and share it with everyone, though. I thought that was really cool. She said it was like one of the greatest experiences. Phenomenal woman. Pretty women wonder where my secret lies. Hmm. I'm not cute or built to suit a fashion model's size. But when I start to tell them, they think I'm telling lies. I say, it's in the reach of my arms, the span of my hips, the stride of my step, the curl of my lips. I'm a woman, phenomenally, phenomenal woman. That's me. I walk into a room just as cool as you please, and to a man, the fellows stand or fall down on their knees. <laughs> then they swarm around me, a hive of honeybees. I say, it's the fire in my eyes and the flash of my teeth, <clears throat> the swing in my waist and the joy in my feet. I'm a woman, phenomenally, phenomenal woman. That's me. Men themselves have wondered what they see in me. They try so much, but they can't touch my inner mystery. When I try to show them, they say they still can't see. <laughs> and I say, it's in the arch of my back, the sun of my smile, the ride of my breasts, the grace of my style. I'm a woman, phenomenally. Phenomenal woman, that's me. Now you understand just why my head's not bowed. I don't shout or jump about or have to talk real loud. When you see me passing, it ought to make you proud. I say, it's in the click of my heels, mm. the bend of my hair, the palm of my hand, the need for my care, because I'm a woman. Phenomenally, phenomenal woman, that's me.